Hey everyone, welcome to today's video. Today's like a super quickie. Um, this video is actually going to serve as a prerequisite for one of my upcoming videos. Um, basically, we're just going to go over how to migrate files from one project to another. A um, re couple of reasons why you might want to do this. You might have already made some, uh, some bits and pieces in another project which work great for another project that you've got. And you might just want to send it over. Another option is if you've done a first person shooter or maybe a puzzle or something else and you just want to have uh, a third person or a first person, any, any, like some of the files, um, you might just want to have a, a character in that level and you're like, oh, okay, I don't know what I could do. You could import one from the marketplace, but again, this is this is just serves as an example of, of migration. So <clears throat> I want to take this character. Um, not just its model but the whole everything um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the third person BP which is responsible for the actual character that runs around the screen and also I'm going to go back and get the mannequin because this has the animations and the actual model of uh, the character that runs around <clears throat> so we're going to need both of those and essentially you can just hit uh, right click so what I, what I did here is I clicked one and then press uh, control on my keyboard, selected the other file, I just then hit right click and select migrate. Now what this is going to do is it's going to give you the option to untick any bits and pieces that you might not actually want, like for example the map, I don't want the map files so let's get rid of those, and the, the overview, I don't really need the overview either. You've got game mode and all that sort of stuff. You can get rid of all, anything that you don't need at this point, uh, like a one meter cube, the chamfered cube, the cube materials, and some floors. Let's get rid of that too. Once you've then got all of the files that you need, you just want to hit OK. And what it's going to do is bring up your file explorer, which at this point, then what you want to do is go to your documents and Unreal projects. If you've got your files saved anywhere else on your computer, navigate to there now. Select the um, folder that you sorry the project that you want to migrate them to open the um, content folder within that and then press select so for this one because this was already sort of like a third person <coughs> um because i've already got some of these files already in there it's just giving me a prompt saying do you want to override these i'm just going to press no um and now it's migrated all the files that i didn't already have F for you if you're exporting these to, or migrating it to a, um, a project that you don't have any of them, you probably won't get that prompt at all. There is another message that you might get saying that you it's not detected a content folder, which I'll do that for you now. Essentially, what that means is when you've when you've gone to migrate, what you've done is you've you've not selected the content folder itself. Uh, so here, if I go back and just select you know here which has only got like the raw files really you want to be inside the content folder but if I don't and just select here it'll go um, it doesn't seem to be in the content folder and this might not work correctly do you want to continue uh, if you get this press no go back get into the content folder press select and then it'll migrate I'm gonna cancel at this point and that's it thank you for watching today's quickie if you liked it please give me a like and please consider subscribing so then you see the following video which is going to include a bit of this. Thank you very much.